Should have come on, but I guess it's right on the verge of coming on. Well, we find the key. Yeah, Jim's cleaning up the shop. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's cleaning up the shop, all right. Jim is messing me up. That's what he's doing. And then he's wondering why I ain't helping him so much. Mess me up. Anybody that wants to know what Jim's doing, all they got to do is go back to uh, last October video. That's what Jim's doing. I got to turn this around. I can't use that. It's not hooked up, not plugged up. I can't even get to my belt sander. Oh, man. He didn't even hook this back up. Uh, he don't know it, but this is a major, major uh, job he is, is doing right here. He don't realize that at all. And well, that <clears throat> certainly kills somebody. Alright, let me see if I can't... Uh, Get back to something on the tractor over here. Dougie, you ought to go over and watch uh, 63 and Pala Two Door. Throw some uh, bucket of ice water on his head. Now that's funny. First off, I went over and watched uh, R. Peak. He went over there and uh, threw a bucket of ice water on his head for a good cause. And that was pretty funny. At least that's what they call a bucket. I think they found the littlest pail they could find. I would call that a, uh, down here in Georgia, we would call that a uh, ash tree. A bucket? I call a bucket a bucket when it's a five gallon bucket. That's what we call a bucket down here. Uh, Alright, let me see what I can do. Oh yeah, and another thing, uh, mm-hmm, see Jim's cleaning up here, and I'm getting 
ideas right here. Uh -huh. I believe I measured that. I think I got that rope down somewhere. Let me see. Yeah, I do right there. Reed length 161 inches long. Let me find the tape. Okay, they're all missing. See if I can get a little measurement on this right here. Yeah. Say 161. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But this is where the heater went, my wood heater. Hmm. Well. I'm thinking about it. That shelf could go. That was the uh, head department. Now it's the chainsaw department. I'm just getting all kinds of my ideas. The big whale's bandsaw can go right here. After uh, at October. This is where I had the other big bandsaw anyway. Paint shakers. Uh, that may be a little problem. But we can deal with that. That would uh, give me all kinds of room back right here. All kinds of room. You put these up or I'll never see them again. That's right, drop one. And another. Through with what? That stuff we're making. Yeah, I want to see how you like it. Who's with you? Uh, Russell and Mary. And Mary? Yeah, she wants to get some maiden. <laughs> I told her you said get some tomatoes. Yes, yeah, sir. She bust me out. Why didn't you get some of I can't get to that bullet right now. Yeah. Unless you move them two ladders for me. 
I can, uh, I can do that. Yeah, if you move them two ladders for me, then I'll make that bullet. All right. Okay. All right. First, hold it, hold it. Let me step way back over here. Uh oh. Oh hell! <laughs> hell <laughs> in Yellow jacket. Yellow jacket. Yeah. In a ladder above ground. Let me show you where that fool's at. The deal is here. I went up to there. Uh, now, if I'd have went up to there like you wanted, we could grind that off, and then you wouldn't have no back on the weld, I was thinking. You know, I could yeah. build this up with weld and build it up with weld. But I had another plan. If I would have took a thick piece of metal and went across here mm -hmm. and notched this part out on the milling machine, yeah, and then went back and milled this part down, mm -hmm. then it would have went over, and I could have took this piece right here and welded it to it. Where it would have been flush out there. Let me see that right there. I can put a spacer under that. Or are you talking about put it down there like that? Well, if you put a spacer on there, ain't you gonna stick up too far? Uh, I didn't drill the hole, but I don't know what size bolt you yeah, want to use. That's fine. Um, quarter inch with this water. right there, I'm gonna have to notch the rubber floor around that, which ain't hurting a thing. Right in here is where the exhaust comes down, right here. Uh -huh. And that's where you can get your shoe against it. Oh. Uh, you know, right in here. But with that right there, you won't slide your foot over. But most of the time, my heel sets about right here because I got my peg up here. And if this is a little short, if it is, if it works out that way, we can always come back and cut this and put one on it up to here. Oh, we can make another one. You ain't got to mess with that. But, uh, yeah, let me, uh, I'll take that and see if, See if that'll work for me, if I can make it work. If I can, I might grind that corner off just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Not touch none of this weld in the here. Just just that corner. Just I was knock thinking it, about that too. Just knock that corner off. It would off come right. over there maybe sixteenth yeah. or so. Yeah, it, it would depends come, on it how would much come you want back to. to about right there. Mm -hmm. So that would probably work out about right. And then uh, rather than chroming it, I'm gonna just paint it black. Put some, uh, I got some epoxy paint. Right. Epoxy primer it and then paint it a gloss black. Yep. With some epoxy and that way, you know, okay. I ain't gonna worry about get, taking it and getting it powder coated and all that stuff. There you go. I poked the nest over there and one of them come down that pole towards me. Just telling Cliff how to eat a hot pepper. He don't know how to eat a hot pepper. And I guess a lot of folks don't. You take a little bite of a hot pepper. And then you put your food in your mouth and eat it. That spices up your food.
No, you'd be better off backhanded. Like oh, I was fixing I to suck do. It down. Oh, you do? Here, let a professional do that. Here, you can do the camera. I'll hit it. Just don't let this gas hit that camera. Yeah, well, if you're going to do crazy backhands. Uh... Ready? They certainly ain't gonna like that. Can't see what they're doing. I didn't get enough on there as I wanted, but I got some on there. Well, you certainly take them all. That's what I wanted. I think the ones that was out of there is ticked off trying to go back in and they don't like the fumes. Huh. the day though. Are they over there? Well, there's hundreds of them things. I'm gonna lead them back this way. Can you see them? I can't see now. Beats on this, maybe I can. <laughs> I have upset the hive. Ha, ha, ha.